A lot of my artwork is inspired by the elements in nature, fire, earth, water and air, and then the fifth element, which is ether, this sort of spiritual dimension. Um, this carpet is called fire opal and it is inspired by the element fire but also the earth and it's uh, representative of the, you know, the red earth that you get up from where I come from actually in the Midwest but also in lots of remote areas of Australia you get this red earth. For me, very grounding. At the same time, it's got this uh, fiery, powerful um, feeling coming from this carpet. When I was painting this, I was just playing around with paint and I found I had a, like a, a red background representing the earth and fire and then I was putting a few colours together on a spatula and then throwing it and I found as I threw it, it would spin in air and then land and I thought, oh, man, that's cool. So a lot of them you'll see that they've captured in the weaving as well. So there was that spontaneous throwing of paint and then there was a dragging down of some of the colours to try and ground it again. I felt like it was becoming too flamboyant or too loose and so I'd ground it again. And then as I was pulling down the paint, I thought this is like a fire opal. Beautiful. So that kind of was an interesting uh, joining in the process of the earthy feel and then the fire element and then the beautiful colours of the fire opal. So for the weavers to capture that spinning is uh, quite a miracle really. Um, such fine weaving they could capture the spinning you can see in different parts of the carpet. Yeah, so this this carpet is quite commanding and bold and, and regal. It doesn't needs attention, like red as a colour is very powerful and often represents power or could represent pain as well. But this uh, colour is uh, it's, it's powerful and it's earthy and it's fiery and it's flashing beautiful colours, the greens, the yellows, the blues, the purples. Yeah, special. This was one of the earlier, design, earlier carpets that we made and this carpet took three weavers, nine months to weave, so they tend to weave more in the winter months um, because they're at home. Um, often they have other jobs where they work in the fields as well, but in winter they're totally inside, so they, most of the work gets done in the winter months. Yeah, so, yeah, it's a beautiful carpet. They've done a great job once again. Um, genius. <laughs>